That is, if they are your real feelings, because, you know, I'm just wondering if you ever speak your mind, or if you just let your parents pull all your strings for you. Look, relax, all right? We gotta ask Chad to the fundraiser because he's helping planning the music for Gwen's and my wedding. You have a problem with that? No, no, he doesn't. You know what? We're all gonna have a great time tonight. Please, please. What the hell is going on here, man? What, you trying to set me up with Whitney? How could I be trying to set you up? I had no idea Teresa was bringing Whitney tonight. Look, we're only staying long enough to pick out a few ideas for the wedding. That's it. Please, Whitney. All right. I'll stay just for a little while. Chad? Whatever, man. I don't care. Congratulations! For what? You're tonight's spotlight couples. At each wedding planner benefit, our brides and grooms-to-be are put through a series of marital moments. At the end of the evening, the couple who's done the best is presented with our Most Perfect Couple Award. Uh, but we're friends, not couples. Well said. Friendship is the basis for a lasting marriage. Gents to the left, little ladies to the right, so you can all prepare for the first event. Good luck, lovebirds. Man, please tell me this is a big practical joke. <laughs> I hope not. Besides, you think I'd be here if I knew about this? Wow. Thank you. Grooms, please take off your ties. Now, the way this works is the grooms to be with the best looking bow tie. You know what? This is ridiculous. I'm not going to do this. Don't be a poop, Whitney. All the money raised tonight is going to the local charities and the youth center. I mean, just, just leave it alone, Teresa. I mean, Whitney only does things she already knows she's good at. The winners of the bow tie event are couple number four and couple number five. <laughs> Congratulations to our brides to be for breaking all previous time records. I hope you're ready for the next event because it's a doozy. We are ready. <laughs> you're great, Teresa. Anyone would think we're a couple for real. It is called How Well Do You Trust Your Partner? <laughs> Gentlemen, if you'll put these on, please. Gentlemen, if you'll hold out your hands. The idea is to feed a piece of wedding cake to your future spouse. Of course, on the big day, it'll be a little easier because you'll all be able to see. <laughs> Gentlemen first. Here <laughs> for our top two couples. These guys and gals are clearly made for each other. We got a little here on your cheek. Oh, this cake's really good. You know, maybe we could use it in our wedding. Think Gwen would like it? I don't know. I do. Now, Teresa, even if we don't win first prize, you make a beautiful bride to be. Really? Well, I wouldn't lie. And you know what? This is a lot of fun. Yeah, I'm having fun too. <laughs> I just wish Chad and Whitney would let themselves enjoy it, too. They will if they're meant to. True love always wins out in the end.